Hi everyone, Hannah here. Welcome back to the channel. For anyone that's new, welcome. My name is Hannah. This is Megan. We are in Sequoia Lodge in Disneyland Paris. We are currently walking to Disneyland Park because we have character breakfast. Now it is the generic character breakfast. Tomorrow is princess, but I'm still doing Ariel today. So Ariel ears, Ariel top, and I have a skirt on because we love practicality. I have Tigger with me because we should meet Tigger. And can we just appreciate Megan's dress for a second? Handmade with autographs and ears. We've got to go once upon a craft ears. Right now, what time is it? It is 10 to 8 on Monday the 18th of September. We can get in the park from 8, which is why we're trying to get there early, get some nice castle pictures. Then we have a character breakfast. It's probably not going to come up the best on camera, but this eye will not stop streaming. So I don't know if you can see in the corner, just there, all the glitter's coming off, which I've just spent quite a while putting on. How annoying. Disaster oh. has struck again. <laughs> you probably couldn't see that. It was an escaped Mickey balloon. Also, we've upgraded to tears now. So, yay for me. Okay, we just walked past the Marvel Hotel. I'm aware I showed Megan then. You will have seen the hotel in the background. I now, there's, <laughs> <laughs> there's security right at the end of the Marvel Hotel because then you're in Disney Village. So as soon as you're through the security here, you're then free to go in the parks. Here is Disneyland Hotel. If only it was open, we could go and have a mooch around. Was it January 24th or 25th? January 25th, it reopens. And they are going to be... <gasps> Megan's birthday! So she has to come back, doesn't she? Yes, everybody say yes. So, they are princess themed rooms. Is it Frozen where it's like the main big suite? There is yes. a Frozen suite. There's lots of suites. Beauty and the Beast. Beauty and the Beast, Cinderella probably, I'll get all of them, all of them. Tangles. I am so excited, it's unreal. Also character breakfast, we have our own entrance. Ooh. Here we go. There's a wall as you come in. There is the main entrance in the middle with the 30th decoration, so I can only presume that they're getting ready to take those down to put Halloween up. Which is a shame, it would have been nice to have a picture just there, but we get to go into the park anyway. Oh, are you ready? No. It's that first side of the castle, isn't it? Oh my goodness. I have never seen the park this empty. What time is it? Right now, it's seven minutes past eight. Our breakfast starts at quarter past. We have a quarter past reservation. Oh, I just want to see the castle. So close. Are you going to cry? I'm not saying I won't. <laughs> Actually, if Megan cries, it will then match my runny eye. So yeah, that was it. I cried at the castle. That's all it is. I don't have a runny eye, even though I do. Oh, 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 oh. Holy moly. PG version. Holy guacamole. Look at this castle. Honestly, in my opinion, this is the most beautiful and detailed Disney castle. Also, look at Main Street. It's so beautiful. Oh my goodness. I'm a, I'm a little bit speechless. A little bit speechless. It's so nice to be back again. Gotta get the pictures. Oh, I love it. We are that early into the park that even the spinners are still asleep. They'll probably start soon when the park kind of officially opens. We're gonna grab a couple of castle pictures really quickly. And then it's breakfast time. But look how beautiful, oh my goodness. The sun shining on the castle. Can we just appreciate the beauty of this for a second? Honestly, it's breathtaking. They've just started to spin. It is time for breakfast. We are going to Plaza Gardens. And this one is the, who are we expecting? We're expecting Tigger, so I've got my Tigger Nuimo. Um, oh, who else? Pinocchio Geppetto. Pinocchio Geppetto. Insert names of other characters here. Oh, there we go, there we go. We have prepaid for this one as well. So we can eat till our bellies are full. It's Eeyore and Tigger! It's Eeyore and Tigger! Oh, we get to meet them properly soon, hopefully. Ooh. 
Here we are. It's Eel. Hi, Eel. Hello. Smile. Yay, perfect. Can I get a picture, please? It's oh, no. Eel doesn't like Tigger. Your friend. <laughs> Hi, Tigger. You ready? Show him your autograph. show a little bit of the food if I can. There's an assortment of pastries and bread. There's some cereal just there. There's some fruits and yogurts, some more pastries. Then there's a hot section, kind of like a full and ghost breakfast section. There are Mickey waffles. There's like an assortment of cheeses and some meats. And then that side is the same. It's kind of mirrored on both sides. We have a Mickey waffle and a kind of Mickey bread. Megan had a Mickey waffle as well. It has to be done. Oh, we have a villain. Hello, Captain Hook. Tigger's going back inside for his break. Bye, Tigger. Oh, there's Donald. Hi, Donald. <laughs> Shaking those tail feathers. Look who it is. It is the one and only Mickey Mouse. Fit as well. Beep beep, there's a car on Main Street. I'd really Look. like to go on it to Small World. We could do Small World because there we, didn't we go. Do it before. We will do Small World at some point. Look how busy it is right now. What day is it? It is Monday the 18th of September. It is, oh, what time? What time is it? 10.24. 10.24. And it's very busy. I feel like because the park recently opened, that's probably why everyone's trying to get the castle pictures in. Look at this beautiful horse. He's called Emmy. Or she. Absolutely beautiful. Okay. It's Megan. <laughs> We are going to have a walk through the castle. This beautiful castle. There is some scaffolding up just there. I'm not sure what that's for. There's a parade going to start in about half an hour, but we'll see. We'll see it this afternoon instead. We want to go do some other bits. 
Also, just down there, that's a great photo of because you've then got the shot of the castle and no one can walk behind you. Also here, for example, great photo of. You can go inside the castle upstairs. There's some be sleeping beauty stained glass windows up there. There's also a shop where you can make your own wand. I will be doing that at some point, so I'll try and show that as well. There's a Christmas shop just there. <laughs> and out into Fantasyland. I've got to say as well, the back of the castle is just as beautiful as the front. It's so detailed. <laughs> There's a little Snow White section as well. It's so nice in here. I think it leads into a gift shop, but it's themed around Snow White. It's like a little hidden gem. It's so beautiful. Oh, there's the evil queen. Well, there she is as the witch. But yeah, it's like a princessy gift shop. But just look at the theming. It's so nice and calm in here. And you can hear like birds as well. And this is the little cottage. Stunning. Okay, the back of the castle, there is this stunning Sleeping Beauty kind of artwork just there. We will be going in a lot of the shops, they will be separate videos. Carousel, and I think we're going to get on Snow White first. have got the end of Belle's dress right there. Belle just walked past. Okay, now we're gonna go on Small World. Where did Belle come from? Beautiful! Okay, so we think we're gonna go on Small World next and then maybe we're gonna try and meet one of the princesses. It is currently 10 past 11. We've just got in the access queue for Small World. So I'll try and let you know when we get on the boat, although it looks very close. So, oh, Mickey's not gonna focus. We're just at quarter past, so it's been about five minutes and we're ready to board. Be prepared to have the song in your head. I might take it out if I'm feeling nice. If I'm feeling mean, I'll leave the song in so it's stuck in your head all day. <laughs>
can't have a water ride without Disney ducks. I don't know if they might be asleep because they're just bobbing along, but they're here for the ride. The Disney ducks. It's actually very nice and warm today, so I don't blame them for having a nice little paddle. It would be nice to have a swim actually. Obviously not in this. Don't ever get into this water. That is not a good idea. Ooh. So it's 11.43 now. We are in the line to meet one of the princesses. It's a gamble. You don't know who you're going to meet. You find out when you go there and you have your picture with them. Obviously I'm dressed as Ariel, but we've seen Snow White and Belle walking through. There's a tree! We've seen Snow White and Belle walking about, so it might be one of them, but you never know who you're going to get. Hello! I'm an adult, but I am crying. You know that just like happy overwhelmingness? That was amazing. They saw my outfit. We were in the line to meet Aurora, and I know that you can't ask to see a princess. They saw how excited I was. And they let me meet Ariel, and she was perfect. Oh dear, right now it is 12.54. Oh, I don't know if you saw that. We're gonna go up in the castle because you can make a personalized one there. We're gonna do that because you need to leave it for half an hour for them to kind of set the top. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna make a wand and then probably pirates in the train around the park.
pick one. I'm gonna go Merlin and Alakazam. I'll go okay. Merlin. Stroke you up. Après deux jours de cours, comme tu l'as fait, vous allez vous faire. Même pour ces lignes, il me rajoute la fin et puis il me donne que du bien. We love a good sword in the stone reference. I zoomed in a bit too much. Whoso pulleth out this sword of this stone and anvil is right, is what right, but I'm gonna start again. Whoso pulleth out this sword of this stone and anvil is rightwise king born of England. We are high above Main Street as we're gonna have a loop on the train and have a relax and then go around pirates. Avec vous et au nom de l'équipe de Steam, je vous souhaite une très belle journée ensoleillée à Disneyland Paris. Thank you! She's so pretty. So we've we went round a couple of times. We've got off at Frontierland. They have some Halloween decorations out. With some pumpkins. We love this. We will come back around here properly later. We're just gonna have a quick go on pirates. And then we're probably gonna go grab our wands and go back to the resort for a little bit, have a relax before we come back later. <gasps> I love these Halloween decorations. There's a scarecrow there. There's a little pumpkin man. Oh, he's got some sunflowers. <gasps> Goofy's there. Goof. Goofy's there in his cowboy outfit. I love that there are just characters about. I love yeah. that detail, which makes it more magical. More Halloween! I don't think I've ever been down this section before. Cowboy goof! Oh, look at these bits! Oh, I think this is like some of the some of the cocoa stuff as well. I love it! Oh, and look at all the, the flower detail on the top of the building as well. I love that. Look at all the cocoa decorations. Oh my word. These are amazing. Oh, and the banners in the trees. I love this. Oh, actually, there's a cocoa quick service. We might eat in there at some point. Right, Thunder Mountain is there. There is the cocoa restaurant directly opposite. We will eat there at some point, whether it's today, maybe tomorrow or Wednesday, we're not sure yet. We will definitely eat there.
getting thoroughly soaked on pirates and making it look like we've wet ourselves, <laughs> we're going to go for a fly with Peter Pan. <laughs> Okay, so we're just gonna get our wands, but as a side note, there is a lift just next to the wand store. So if you want to get down to the dragon, but you can't do stairs, there is a lift available. the resort but imagine the sweets up there also at the very top there's a tinkerbell and she moves around I would love to be able to see one of the refurb sweets it was like a sneak peek so we're heading back to the resort now update on the eye it's complete I patched it up a little without the glitter it's restreamed again what's happening don't know eye sarkas so we're going to rest and relax for a bit, have a change of outfit because we got rained on. There was a little rain spell just before the parade, so a little bit damp. Rest, relax. We're planning on eating in the Coco restaurant later. Very excited for that. It's a quick service style. So, I mean, for you, it's going to be a second. For us, it will be a couple of restful hours. Just like that, we have changed. What time is it now? 18.18. We are going back into the park, even though you've just seen us come out of the park. We are Halloweened, well, I'm Halloweened up. Megan's princessed up. Just in case you're bothered, the eye stream is continuing. Try to patch it up. We'll just see what happens tomorrow. So we're gonna eat in the Coco restaurant. It's like a quick service and I'm pretty sure they have, it's a souvenir cup, isn't it? Yes. They have a souvenir cup of some sort, which I'm gonna get it. I will show the food. Look how quiet it is. It's so quiet. Well, I suppose it's because everybody's in the parks, but still. We also aren't 100% sure. We keep hearing bird noises. Now, obviously, some of them we know are real. But do they pipe bird noises in as well? We can't always tell. Or is it like a little party bush going on? The beautiful Sleeping Beauty Castle. It does look a little bit quieter than earlier. I mean, a lot of people, we did see a lot of people leaving as we were coming in. Oh, we want to get some food. Oh, here it is. Oh, I can't wait. Can we just appreciate the beauty of this sign as well? Here's a quick look at the menu. It's mainly like burritos. And desserts, the all-important desserts. Oh, yeah, there's a beef burrito, chicken, a vegan one, and a 
Oh, I thought it said small beef. I think there is a small beef one as well. And then you can get some chicken strips. Oh, there you go, small and chicken strips. It's so, it smells so good in here. The menu's up there again. I did see, I think it's just behind where that guy's standing. Oh, here it is. There's the cup. So here's the cocoa mug. It does come with hot chocolate, but you can have it as just the mug and it comes in plastic. But I did want to try it to see what it's like. So if I very carefully shimmy it around. Look how beautiful this is. Oh, I'm trying to be careful because there's so much cream on the top. It's like a hot chocolate and Oreo dust, I think she said. And then we've both just had a kid's burrito. So I know the lighting isn't great in here, but this is, the, well I got the child's one which was six euros, it's quite big, I've only had two bites off the top. That's the inside. Ooh. It's really nice, it says spicy beef. It's not what I would call spicy, it's just got like a nice warmth to it. So far, unless there's spice in the middle that I've not got to yet. This is really good and it's huge, like for six euros, that's a lot. The adult one, I think is two of these. That would have been too much for me personally, but the theming in this restaurant is absolutely amazing. Also, over there, oh, there's the guitar. Oh, there's a person. There's the guitar. It's so nice here. So it's getting a bit dark now. It is, what is it? Uh, four minutes past eight. This section just here by Frontierland with all the, is it Dia de los Muertos? Um, it's empty. Well, I say it's empty, there are people here now. We've been here for the past five minutes doing a couple pictures and it's been pretty much empty. There are some phenomenal picture spots. Phenomenal, yes, phenomenal. I hope that word sometimes foxes me. But there is Big Thunder Mountain. There's a little bit of wayfinding. But it's so nice in this section. Even the music, it's just lovely. Can we just appreciate this statue as well of Miguel? So there's been a change of plan. We're heading back to the resort. I will tell you for why in a moment. Okay, so we came back early because it started to rain and we thought they might not do the fireworks in the rain. It has stopped now. Look, like right now the fireworks are about to start. It's nine o'clock. But we started to flag a little bit and we don't want to overdo it and then not feel good for the rest of the trip. So we did come back early. We're gonna just have a chill, have a relax, because we have to get up early for princess breakfast tomorrow as well. Princess breakfast. We each bought a wand. Now I'll show mine properly in a haul video. I might grab a quick clip of Megan's in a sec. And also a, a balloon, not a balloon, an umbrella. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna pop that clip in right now. Okay, so this is the wand that Megan got. Oh, one-handed. She chose the blue box and she went with a bell theme. So there's this pink. Oh, okay, I'm gonna put it there. And hopefully, if I put it on the white, the colors will show. So we've got this beautiful pink at the top, and then she went with blue and yellow for Belle and Beast, and then red for the rose. There's all the crystals, and, oh, what did you have engraved? Oh, Disney 2023, engraved. It's probably a bit hard to see on the camera, but it is engraved just there. Look how sparkly it is. So it was 49.99 for the wand and then six euros for the engraving. Now, when I did it last December, you didn't get a fancy box with it, but this time you got a fancy box. There was a choice of colors. There was this blue, there was a brownish type one and green. Now there's no difference in the ones except the boxes are massively different. So here's the brolly. Please excuse that it's in the bath. You can imagine we were walking back in the torrential rain. So it's the small world one. It's one where you just press that for it to go up and down. Look how beautiful that is. This one, I believe this one was about 30 euros, but it did the job. Highlight of the day for me, undoubtedly has to be meeting Ariel. I cried, I'm an adult, I cried. It was kind of overwhelming, all happened. And I had my Ariel bound on and she was perfect in every sense of the word. She was amazing. What was your highlight of the day? I think it was the parade, because it was lovely. That was so good. Oh, and Tiana. And Tiana, so the interaction with Tiana yes. at the parade. because Megan has her dress on with all the, the characters' autographs and she had Tiana there. Was she lovely. was beautiful. 
so it's been an amazing day but we are just getting a bit tired we don't know how we do it so we did come back tomorrow princess breakfast which i'm very excited for i am going to foolishly try heatless hair curlers overnight so wish me luck for that probably won't go well but we'll give it a go watch this face <laughs> fingers crossed mm -hmm. but thank you all so much for watching don't forget to like and subscribe and i'll see you in the next video bye